Hello, everybody. Hi, it's so nice to be here with you all. I wish I could be with you in person. Um, I have been able to watch much of the festivities online and on Facebook. And it's just a lovely celebration today and, and the conference has been so rich. Uh, the Office of International Affairs at IUPUI is delighted to be a co-host of for the second Spring Flowers International Conference. And I am proud uh, for the third time now to be representing Indiana University, Purdue University, and Indiana University more broadly at this uh, Union Day celebration. Today, the 76th Myanmar Union Day celebration and the closing ceremony. The Burmese American Community Institute is so vital to the greater Indianapolis community. And I am so proud to consider BACI an important partner for IUPUI and the IUPUI Office of International Affairs. I consider the Burmese American Community Institute friends. Um, and, and, I, and I say that with uh, the deepest heartfelt gratitude for what they do um, for our community here and the community all over the world, um, particularly the community in Myanmar, Burma. Uh, so thank you, uh, the Burmese American Community Institute, for hosting such a superb and thoughtful series of conversations about advancing democracy in Myanmar. Uh, these global conversations around Myanmar and our Burmese community are so crucial to the world, um, as well, of course, to the Office of International Affairs. I do want to mention that we have a, a fairly substantial Burmese uh, student body. We have more than 150 students at IUPUI who are Burmese, um, and we're so proud um, to have them selected IUPUI uh, and, um, and, of course, Indiana University more broadly for their educational goals. We have so many problems around the world. Today, every day, it's relentless. It really is relentless. And our problems are just too complex to be solved by any one institution, by any one nation, any one sector, any one organization. And this is why this conference is, is so vital, so important, and why Union Day is the perfect time to hold such a critical conversation conversation that is global and collective, and that together is envisioning a democratic future of Myanmar. So on this Union Day celebration, and as we close this very important conversation, let me say that I personally look forward to seeing how together through all of our conversations, locally, globally, how we can all work together to make the world a better place, a more peaceful place, a more just place for generations to come. Thank you so much for allowing me to say some concluding remarks and congratulations for a wonderful conference and a, a very um, beautiful and, and moving celebration today. Thank you very much.